All right, everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to keep this very short and simple because I just did an hour-long video no one's going to watch. Please watch it. It's very, very informative, but it is an hour-long video, so, you know, when you have time. All right. Um, is AI art art? The short answer is yes, and I'm not going to argue this. I'm going to give you my reasons, and I'm going to shut up. Reason number one, art is subjective. Anything can be art. If your cat pukes in the living room and swipes it with his paw, that's art. Cats can make art. There is nothing in the, in the universe that says only humans can make art. So don't come at me with computers aren't human, so they can't make art. Second point I'm going to make is I've seen AI art. I've gone to the prompts, typed in a sentence, and got something that was absolutely 1,000% interpreted interpreted it took liberties and made choices that is art art is seeing something in this case the computer sees my prompt and says oh okay and then interpreting that prompt that is art i studied art in high school and in college all through high school all through college art is also taking the world around you and reimagining it. So here's an example I use. Let's say I took a magazine and I took the scissors to this magazine. I did not photograph any of these pictures. Those are not my pictures. Those pictures are somebody else's pictures. And I take the scissors and I cut them up. And I take a piece of cardboard and I make a collage out of those pictures and I take a photograph of that collage. That photograph is art. It's taking somebody else's art and reinterpreting it, but it's still an original work of art. It is still a legit 1000% original work of art. Your AI computer does the same goddamn thing. It takes a Google image sheet and says, here. I'm going to take this piece from this image and this piece from this image and this piece from this image and throws it together and makes something new. Yes, it's borrowing from other artists' work and making something new. So is fan fiction. So are fan movies. So is when, when you go to Instagram or Twitter or wherever and you pay a starving artist $500 to draw a picture of Goku eating a cheeseburger. They are taking something that doesn't belong to them, Goku, and making it an original work of art that is theirs using somebody else's art. That is still art. Doesn't matter. It is still art. It is no different when a computer does the same goddamn thing. Now, final point I'm going to make and I'm going to shut up. Portrait painting is art. Photography is art. Photography, new technology, replaced portrait painting. You do not go into Walmart or JCPenney or wherever, sit down for four hours and pay an, a painter to sit there and make a portrait of you. Nobody has done that for over a hundred years. For over a hundred years. For thousands of years, that's how photography was done. It was an artist with a paintbrush and a canvas taking a photograph with their mind and putting it on the canvas. A photograph of a person is art. A painting of a person is art an AI computer making an anime interpretation of that photograph is still art it is I'm not saying it is or isn't good art I'm not saying it is or isn't worthy of commercial usage and I'm not saying it should or shouldn't replace human artists I am not saying that I am just saying, in the strictest sense, it is absolutely 1,000% art. 